What is up YouTube, Rain Dark HD here today and I'm going to do a little bit of a commentary over my holiday that I just had, Amsterdam and Budapest. Um, so, <coughs> here we are going on to the flight from uh, England to Amsterdam and uh, in this video I'm just going to be like giving a bit of context to everything that we did there because I got, it was just going to be like a little montage thing but uh, it wouldn't make any sense if I didn't have any commentary over it. I like to tell you about my experience and stuff. So uh, here's the train going from uh, the train the uh, airport to the centre of Amsterdam. And here's the hotel that we stayed at. It was quite a nice hotel. We had a nice view, everything. Uh, quite satisfied. So if you're gonna go to Amsterdam, I recommend it. It's really close to the centre. You could actually walk it. Um, I think it's like a 20 minute walk, something easy like that. We're staying on the 7th floor so we had quite a nice view from our room, which is the highest floor you could stay at, which is number 7, yeah. Um, and our room is really nice. And you guys will see, there you go. It's quite a spacious room for uh, a hotel room, usually it's just like, um, bed and you got like one passageway and then you got a bathroom that's it and here's a little view that we had it's quite nice very very nice uh second day woke up went to the center of um amsterdam got some bikes rode around for a bit just you know to see the uh the area see what it's like not just staying in the hotel room going out at night time getting drunk and high and whatever you know um things you do in amsterdam uh yeah we decided to stop off get some chinese food you know we've had chinese food before but we never had it like abroad it's it's very very different like our chinese food is completely different to theirs you know just riding our bikes again having a jolly good time there's some pictures of me in the park that we rode to and here's the red light district now I did not record people because it's very offensive and the girls get very pissed off but if you've been there you know what it's like um, yeah it was a crazy experience to be honest here we are in the center of Amsterdam like the shopping center or whatever they want to call it it's quite a nice place loads of shops it's massive i can't compare it to london but it's, it's just very different there's loads of places to go loads of shops and it's very different to like the type, type of shops we have here and their style is just very different as well Cool little cinematics of some birds. Run that again. Yeah, yeah. And then we, we, we walk over like, why are all these birds flying while they're all landing here? We walk over and these people are holding the birds in their hand. Nah fam, that's just mad. These pigeons have been everywhere and anywhere. You're mad to be fit and I bet these tramps didn't even wash their hands either. Bet you didn't even wash their hands. Them things can't run. Then man I gotta walk, walk over to McDonald's straight away after that. After we went and got some food, went to a steakhouse. Very nice. Um, I think after that we got really high and decided to walk back to the hotel instead of getting like no 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 wait do we have the no no we still had the bikes at this time we we're just walking around went back here's the view daytime of the hotel uh, last time I showed you night time went to the train station oh yeah yeah so we did get rid of the bikes at that time so this train station was bringing us back to the airport we're going to Budapest now 
and I've been to Amsterdam before but I've never been to Budapest so Budapest was a completely different experience I've never seen anything and you're like what, what the hell's Budapest Budapest is in Hungary Hungary is like quite quite south of Europe I think it's like I don't know I don't have one map on me right now but it's it's like a two and a half hour flight from England and Amsterdam was like a 40 minute flight so you can see the distance it's very different it was way hotter there as well like Amsterdam was quite cloudy and cold the sun was always out in Budapest it was quite nice <coughs> here's the center so I, I've never been here before it's quite a good experience um, yeah man traveling the world rain dark hd so here we stayed in an apartment instead of getting a hotel because in budapest i thought that hotels are nice but they're very very overpriced so i was like uh, let's see this apartment it was really nice actually um but yeah we had a, we had our own space we were with like other people are around us but they actually live there so they know like to keep quiet and stuff they have respect for other people um so yeah, i do recommend this place as well very nice very warm as well two beds as you can see there's one upstairs as well and over here you had like quite a nice view of um the uh, apartment yeah, so the second day we went like sightseeing, you cannot go to a new place and not go sightseeing. It's like, what's the point in even going there? So we jumped on this tour bus, got my phone out, just like recording everywhere. And it was, it was very nice to see like their historical buildings, I guess. It's quite interesting. And the views in Budapest, man, is nice. I wouldn't want to live there personally but it's just i think it's a very high tourist attraction i know loads of america i think i saw more american people than hungarian people honestly it was crazy and then this bug oh these bugs that they got there they're nah fam they just move mad they've got loads of them there i've never seen them in my life they've got loads of them and here's like the, the octagon, I think they call it. Quite a nice place. Yeah, so I'm just gonna add a bit of pictures in between these clips now because the pictures that I took. This is all on my uh, Samson S9 by the way, so for you guys that are saying Samson, uh, Android, pitch quality is uh, trash, you yep. know, mm, debatable, it's very debatable sir. iPhone on Snapchat, yeah, it's nice, okay, yeah, yeah, you win, but overall if you, you're going abroad and you want to be taking pictures, you can't be taking on that iPhone 30 FPS trash. 720p, you know, unacceptable. And they are exactly the same height because the religion and the politics has to be on the same level. And it's not allowed to build higher buildings than this too. Very interesting facts from that guy. He said that uh, the parliament and the church can't be higher than another one or something like that. Very interesting, saying that no buildings can be higher than that uh, that one. And man, just look at these views, man. We went up now, uh, and that's like the highest mountain or whatever in uh, Budapest. It's very nice to go up there and just look around and stuff. We walked back down, across the bridge, um, got some food. And we jumped on a boat ride, which you'll see in a second. So everything in Budapest is just so nice. The lighting, the water, the views, the food, bruh, everything, man, everything. So, yeah, this boat, this boat ride was just really nice. Uh, after the boat ride, we went back to the apartment, and we decided to go. 
clubbing. So I've never been clubbing abroad. I always go clubbing in uh, my my hometown. Never. I've been like in other cities before in England clubbing. It's kind of different. But going abroad, bruh, it's just completely different. Different music, different type of like. Like their type of music is like 10 years behind, man. You'll see in a second when I got some, I got some clips of us in the club. You can hear the music that they're playing. Like they're playing some music from like 2003, 2006. It's kind of crazy, man. Like you would never hear this type of music in the clubs in, in Birmingham. Or the clubs that I go to anyway. <laughs> hear the type of music that I was talking about so next day woke up was it hungover because I don't I don't get hungover but apparently these three guys were they're were actually I'm pretty sure they're still drunk I don't know what they were drinking but yeah they were having a jolly good time man it's funny um, yeah so we just decided to walk around went shopping bought a few stuff from the Gucci store the Louis store um, and then we basically just chilled after that came back about midnight um yeah went to oh yeah, i think we went to the night store here picked up some new jays you know how i do man you know how i do oh yeah in between before i went back as well we were talking to these women and uh, they gave us like free foot spa and everything. It was kind of crazy. Yeah. And there were actually no black people there. It's weird. No black like, people staring at us all the time. But yeah. And then this is a flight back. We had just arrived in London. Um, pretty nice flight. Weird landing. So I was half asleep. Yeah, man. Good holiday. I recommend going to Amsterdam and Budapest. I preferred, uh, I liked Budapest a bit more because it's a different experience. But yeah, definitely recommend it. Uh, thanks for watching, like, comment, subscribe. Peace.